Hello, hi there, that's right, it's the great and glorious Super Things One Day in Dutch, and I'm back here yet again for, guess what, another delightful tarot reading. Now, we've got this YouTube inquirer who I think the channel name is Vitty Kitty. <laughs> now, she broke up with someone about six months ago. Um, she still thinks about him, but she's got someone else in her life at the moment. But she's still thinking, like, will the ex return? Well, I think there's only one thing for it. And that's for me to give you a quick tarot reading and tell you what the reading says. My job here is just to pass on the message, basically. And the message will be whatever the reading says. So, let's just take it one step at a time, as people say, and we'll see whether we can get you some clarity, some guidance, or a different perspective. I'm shuffling like crazy now, still the great and glorious book of Thoth Tarot. Because it's the one I use professionally, it's, it's at hand, I'm lazy, whatever. <laughs> but anyway, this is the tarot pack I'm using at the moment. Let's just have a quick look. We'll have a look on your side of things, on your current boyfriend's side of things. We'll have a look at the relationship there first, and I'll expand the reading to have a look at the X. Hmm. Alright, so this is based loosely upon the 8-card relationship method. So we always have signs for yourself, and then signs for your partner, and the forces between. So what I've done is I've put in another forces between you for your X, and I've expanded that still further. Now, as far as you still thinking about your X is concerned, there's a sense of um, stress, maybe powerlessness, a feeling of fear and anxiety, uh, which is there in the, in the Devil card, okay? It's not actually a very, it's not a very evil sign. It can talk about passion, it can talk about that attraction, it can also talk about powerlessness, powerlessness, and that's one of the ways in which I personally read the Devil card, because it's talking about that uh, feeling of, you know, oh my God, you know, what's really going on here? So, I feel that you're still feeling the pain of the breakup, rather than feeling the joy of the new connection. Now, the guy you're with at the moment, tremendous and I mean tremendous all right because the sense there is full of you know you are the one he's he's after that's the star card they're often called the wish card when you wish upon a star okay he likes you a lot definitely and he sees you as being a very stable and solid individual as is evident within the queen of discs there so he appreciates you something to work on something to grow on you've got a foundation in place and the feelings and the thoughts between you, no, it's not a perfect loving bond, but it's a new relationship, so you're building it up so it can become that way. And if I was to expand that reading a little further, again, we got very strong cup signs. That would imply that your current relationship, not the relationship with your ex, but your current relationship, has actually got an awful lot going for it. And that's something that you've just got to remember, okay? It's got a lot going for it. So think about the importance of what you've got right now, okay? Now, let's try, try and expand and have a look and see what's on your exercise side of things. Now, the forces between yourself and him, quite easy to understand. It's, it's the era, the era which is gone, the eon, okay? So, yeah, he misses you. That much we can say. Do we have very strong loving signs? We've got some strong loving signs on his side of things, but it's, it's reversed, and there's a sense of there being interference there. So it would make sense to me that he's maybe connected with somebody else. Alright, so the relationship with the ex, it's looking less strong than the relationship with your current partner. Okay, so that's something else to bear in mind. Let's, let's have a quick look to see if he will try and come back. Okay, obviously that was your main question. And yeah, we have very, very strong romantic signs there. But we've got to think whether those are the desire for a future with you, or whether those are the actual future there with you. That's an important thing to bear in mind. But if I was reading on him, just you and him today, I would say it would be quite likely that the ex will split up with whoever he's been with, and will try and make some kind of reconnection with you. This could cause some confusion or anxiety associated with you at the moment, primarily because your relationship with your current boyfriend is getting stronger and stronger by the day, uh, which means that you know you could have some difficulties when it comes to the point of trying to make you know your future actually happen. My recommendation would be to focus on what you've got in the here and now, see how far it can go. All right, make it work. And then see how see how much the X has grown in the future. So I suppose to recap, yeah, I feel that your instincts could be correct there. I feel he could be coming back. 
but I'm erring more on the side of thinking that these signs are more to do with the aspirations for the future rather than, boom, the actual future. And I think that's something you've got to bear in mind as well. Okay? Great and glorious and be famous one day Nick Dutch. Signing out for now. All requests by private message and not in the comment section, but do feel free to leave me a little present down there if you wish. And we'll speak again very, very soon. Bye for now.